These leopard print candy apples are so cute. I'll show you how to assemble. Dip. Design. And decorate. But first, let me introduce myself. I am the DIY Queen Diva. Make sure you hit that like, subscribe, and notification bell to keep updated with me and all of my videos on the weekends and pop-up videos during the week. You will need three cups of sugar, one cup of corn syrup, this is Walmart's brand, and one cup of water. But make sure you get all of your corn syrup out of your measuring cup. Okay, so go ahead and give it a stir after you add your water. I am going to add Wilton's White. Okay. I am going for a nude color, so I am going to add Hobby Lobby's Brown. And this is Hobby Lobby's brand. It's gel food coloring. Okay, so this is um, more of a tan color, so I am going to add a little soft pink, Hobby Lobby soft pink. And again, I am going for a nude color. Okay, I will add one more drop of soft pink. Okay, so this color looks about right. I am going to go ahead and add it on the stove until it reaches 300 degrees. Until it reaches 300 degrees, I am going to go ahead and assemble my apples. Okay, so I am going to go ahead and place the wooden stick in each apple. And then I will place my Hobby Lobby straws over the wooden sticks. The wooden sticks also came from Hobby Lobby. Okay, I'm giving my apple a little shake to make sure the apple will not fall off the wooden stick while dipping my apples. Okay, so I am just going to repeat the process with the rest of the apples. Okay, so I made some bows for my candy apples. If you need to learn how to make bows with twist ties or without, go ahead and click on the link above or either down in the description. Okay, so let's go ahead and dip these apples. So you make sure you place your apple all the way in the candy and rotate, bring it up and scrape off any extra candy off the bottom of your apple to prevent extra candy on your apples if you want your candy apples to be picture perfect it's best to scrape the bottom of your apple so you won't have that extra candy on the bottom So I really like how my apples came out. So let's go ahead and get these apples decorated. You will need your brown and black gel food coloring and your treat brushes. So basically you're going to dab brown, um, 
food gel coloring on your apples and then you're going to go on the outside with black outline the brown with black and I'll show you here you don't want your spots your leopard spots to be the same size so you just dab them one make one smaller make one bigger however you want to design your candy apple So I have my black gel food coloring and I am just going to outline all of the brown leopard spots until I'm finished. This really, really looks cute at the end. So I really do like them. Okay, so these are really cute. I am just going to attach my candy apple bows on the candy apple stick by dabbing a little bit of hot glue on the back of the bow and attach it on the treat stick or the candy apple stick. And that's it. If you have any questions or comments, make sure you leave them down below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that bell button to keep updated with my videos as soon as I post. Bye bye. Have a great evening.